is by taking hold of folks accountable who choose violence. Holding folks accountable who choose violence. That's the top of the list for Winston-Salem's new police chief when it comes to addressing violence in the city. Good evening and welcome to the Fox 8 5 o'clock news. I'm Neil McNeil. And I'm Katie Nordine. Chief William Penn Jr. took over the role as top cop today. He sat down with Fox 8's Aaliyah Sims. And Aaliyah, I know he is coming in at a tough time, even with his experience as former assistant chief. Yeah, Katie, he enters this role with the start of the year has been a violent one with eight homicides in the city already this year. And we have to realize we're just in month one. Now, this also comes after the Memphis police video of Tyree Nichols was released. Law enforcement agencies across the country, they're starting to lose trust. But Chief Penn says he has a plan for that. Despite 25 years of experience with the Winston-Salem Police Department, Chief William Penn admits these times are unique and becoming more and more difficult. It is a tough time and the violence doesn't help either. He's talking about the eight homicides the city of Winston-Salem has seen so far this year, including 12-year-old Entity Morales, who was shot and killed at Weston Park when a fight started. I can tell you that the Winston Salem Police Department put all our efforts into curbing the violence and holding those who choose violence uh, accountable doing it because of the damage they're doing to our community. He says the work starts with forming relationships with the community. After video footage of Tyree Nichols' violent arrest in Memphis was released, he knows some of that trust may be tarnished. Police departments across the nation are, are repulsed. That type of video erodes the trust of the community, which is at the core of what we need. To be able to do our jobs effectively, we need to work with the community on that. And that job is getting tougher, too. Right now, there are more than 100 officer vacancies in the Winston-Salem Police Department. While the department is working to fill those positions, Chief Penn says you can't just put anyone in a uniform. We have a, a robust um, vetting system. In fact, it, it probably probably adds to our shortages because it takes a long time to vet folks um, to give them the responsibility of, community, uh, of protecting this community. We take that serious and there's no shortcutting with that. In the last two years, Winston-Salem Police Department implemented new technology, including shot spotters and a real-time crime center. I asked Penn if it's helping. Keep working with us. It's going to take all of our efforts. We didn't get here overnight. Penn is a Carver High School grad, and he's confident he will make a difference in the city he was born and raised in and loves so much. I get things done through, through relationships. I believe in meeting people where they are. I believe in starting a conversation where we, where we agree and then moving further. Now, a few weeks ago, I interviewed an officer here at this police station about the deadly Weston Park shooting. Now, she broke down in tears when speaking with me about the tragedy, so we know that these types of crimes personally impacts officers. Now, ahead at 6, how the new chief plans to protect the well-being of those officers while keeping them on the force. Live in Winston-Salem, Aaliyah Sims, Fox 8 News. See you.